A suicide attempt at a local jail has officials questioning if they're doing enough to protect inmates. Good evening. Thanks for watching. I'm Matt Davenport. Investigators will be combing the Banner County Jail for clues about what led to an inmate attempting to commit suicide and how deputies handled the incident. Logan McDougal was at a news conference at the Banner County Sheriff's Office. Logan, what can you tell us about the inmate? Matt, 31-year-old Barton Richard Galloway was booked into the jail on Tuesday, arraigned on Wednesday, and then Sheriff Laura Nielsen tells us he about killed himself this morning. Galloway, who has had multiple run-ins with the law over the last 15 years, now faces charges of lewd conduct with a child under 16. Bond is set at $50,000 and a preliminary hearing is scheduled for May 3rd, pending his recovery. In the meantime, Sheriff Nielsen says independent investigators from Teton and Jefferson counties will be on hand to determine if any policy violations occurred. Uh, Sheriff Nielsen explains while suicides do happen often, do not happen often, he wants to make sure his men and women are doing all they can to protect the inmates. But it is something that uh, is part of uh, institutional life and uh, we're trying to make sure that uh, all of our I's are dotted, our T's are crossed, and if there's any policy violations that we can change to make sure that this kind of stuff doesn't happen. Galloway is currently in intensive care at Polk, uh, Portniff Medical Center. Matt, back to you. All right. Thank you very much. Logan McDougall from our Pocatello Newsroom.